Who is the secret agent that keeps on appearing in the Skibbity Toilet videos? What is his purpose and is he good or is he bad? Well, let's find out, shall we? And like always, let's find out by looking at what we know for sure. Like facts and the evidence. All right, let's get into it. So in every episode where he appears, he's basically standing somewhere on the side and not interacting with anything. It's basically like a little Easter egg inside every single episode of the Skibbity Toilets. Well, not every single one, but most of them. And especially the later ones. We see him in like the most obscure places where you have to look like 50 times over the video to find him. It's like find Waldo, but in the Skibbity universe. So it's find the secret agents. <laughs> and like I said, he doesn't do anything at all except Except for in one episode, episode 47, when he actually approaches the cameraman that is like our point of view cameraman and he helps him up. So does that mean he's actually good or does he help him up or does he do something else to him? Well, let's find out because I think he has some ulterior motives. It looks kind of bad for the secret agent. So yeah, let's get into it. And of course, I got some wild theories about everything. But before we get into those theories, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos coming out. And so you can stay up to date on every single new game that is coming out and theory. And also make sure to tell your friends about the channel as well. I think they would like it a lot too. And thank you to all who just subscribed. You are my family now. You can never leave now. All right, back to the mysterious agent. Okay, so from everything we know, it shows us this that this agent likes to stand around like he just pooped his pants and he's waiting for his mom to come or something. He's just standing there like this. Yeah, like that. <laughs> like he doesn't move ever. Like I said, just in one video and that's it. Everything else, he's just standing there like that. And yeah, let me show you what I'm talking about real quick. So you see that, right? He's literally standing right there in every single video, like in this, in the corner somewhere doing nothing, just like watching the whole thing happen. So why is he a silent observer most of the time? Why is he just standing there? I feel like he could be controlling the cameraman because every time he appears, he's standing there and looking like he's concentrated on the battle. So maybe he's like the main person who's helping the cameraman kill the skibbity toilet. Or maybe he's controlling the skibbity toilets and helping them kill the cameraman. That makes sense too, right? Because in episode 47, when he comes up to the toilet, he basically turns off the camera. Like he does something to the cameraman and he dies, I guess, or something bad happens to him. Or a more plausible theory could be he could be controlling both of them the cameraman and the skibbity toilet. That would make him even more evil, right? Because he's controlling both sides and he's there witnessing it all just for the destruction. So he's basically like a kind of a god creature, you know, that is that is like looking and controlling the cameraman and the skibbity toilets. Or is he like the god of the whole universe that we are in right now? And he made all that just for his pleasure. And he's just looking at everything, everybody like killing each other. And he's like, oh yeah, that's nice. I really like what's going on here right now. Or maybe he like, he, he's looking down at it, all that stuff. And he's like, man, I wish I didn't create all those dumb freaking skibbity toilets or, or the damn cameraman. You know, he's like just looking at them and like, what the frick did I just do, you know? <laughs> and in that case, I feel like he is kind of the representation of the fuck boom, the guy that is basically the creator of the whole channel. And yeah, that would make him the creator of the whole universe and he is watching it for his own entertainment or our entertainment. Dang, that is actually deep. Can you imagine if he's actually the fuck boom? He basically created the whole universe just for our entertainment and his. So he's kind of good, right? Does that make him good because he's entertaining us? Or does that make him bad because because he's like killing a bunch of skibbity toilets and skibbity cameraman. <laughs> well, I honestly think that the secret agent is actually evil and he made both the cameraman and the skibbity toilet. Because if you look at the skibbity toilets and the cameraman, they basically all have like kind of the same tech, you know, it's going up and up and up and up every single time. And also real quick in the new episodes, it looks like the, the cameramen are always winning. Like I don't remember the last time the freaking episode ended with the skibbity toilets winning. Because when the Titan TV man and the Titan speaker man came together they've been destroying everybody basically like there's no mercy for nobody they even killed the charlie toilet poor freaking charlie toilet man i feel like that guy deserves more than a couple episodes honestly like like listen listen to this real quick <laughs> so 
So yeah, that guy definitely deserved some more credit, bro. That thing was awesome. I liked the freaking scream that they put in and all that. It was like amazing. It was the peak freaking performance. But anyways, back to why I think the secret agent is actually evil. In the glorious 47th episode where we actually see him up close, it looks like he comes up to the cameraman and he does something to it. And it basically turns him off, ending the episode. So what the heck did he do to him, right? Well, I think he either killed him or took out his memory card for something, you know? He just, he needed it for something. Maybe that's the footage. Can you imagine? Like, if it's actually the fuck boom, like in the universe, he takes the footage of every single cameraman that, that dies or basically he kills them. He takes that footage and then uploads it to YouTube. <laughs> that's like a whole breaking the fourth wall and everything, you know? And that would be cool if there was like a freaking skibbity toilet universe and there's a bunch of toilets fighting cameraman. That sounds pretty interesting, honestly. So yeah, whoever the agent is, he seems very powerful and unaffected by all the chaos around him at the least and at the most controlling all the chaos around him or maybe just transmitting it to us he's just literally some guy that like runs around and collects all the tapes and then uploads it to youtube <laughs> that would be like i feel like that would be the best explanation for him but I, I wonder if we're gonna see him in like different episodes like his character actually like go somewhere you know or is he gonna stay on the sidelines all the time not even appearing in any of the other episodes ever you know or who knows we're i guess we're gonna have to wait and see but those are some interesting theories right well at least i think so but yeah if you guys have any more information about all this stuff feel free to leave a comment because i feel like i do not know a lot about this stuff and you might know even more than me so yeah I i'm sure i missed something so if i missed something make sure to yeah let me know speaking of the 47th episode let's watch it real quick because i feel like it's very important to watch and figure out what it is about basically right so yeah let's watch it real quick So yeah, that episode is basically about the epic fight between the G-Man toilet and the Titan TV man. So yeah, and that's that's how it begins. And it ends with the freaking mysterious agent who literally looks like the fuck boom. Who's profile picture is literally i feel like the the guy but with like a smile and glasses you know because yeah he looks pretty pretty similar he does have glasses as well and yeah that's it guys if you enjoyed the video please make sure to leave a like and subscribe wait that's the opposite that's subscribe that's like make sure to leave a like <laughs> and subscribe there you go that's the right way to do it but yeah my name is oshi and peace out bye <coughs> i meant bye <laughs>